most women have experienced the fear of walking home alone. Keys in hand, constantly checking behind, crossing the road to avoid men who make them feel uncomfortable. It is a terror soap star Nikki Sanderson knows all too well. And now, as figures show a sharp rise in attacks on women, Nikki is fronting a new home office campaign to prevent more deaths like those of Sarah Everard and Sabina Nessa. She is calling for action to stop the abuse and harassment of women on the street, pleading with the public to stop turning a blind eye. Nikki, 38, says, even something like catcalling, where you have people shouting derogatory, nasty things at you and you are on your own is massively intimidating. I've also spoken to people who have experienced different volumes of microaggressions towards women. It can be hard to say, I feel uncomfortable about this, but you should be able to call it out. It has become very prevalent in our society and we need to put a stop to it. Nikki is supporting the latest phase of the Home Office's Enough campaign, ahead of International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women on November 25. And she has the lead role in The Long Walk Home, a Home Office-backed episode of Hollyoaks which shows what happens to Nikki's character Maxine Miniver when she is separated from friends on a night out. The Enough campaign highlights different forms of abuse and violence against women and girls, from street harassment to sexual assault and cyber flashing. Its latest phase asks people to intervene when they see violence or harassment against women, particularly in the street. Office for National Statistics figures show a 21% rise in police-recorded sexual assaults since pre-pandemic times, and the risks women face have been laid bare by the murders of Sarah Everard and Sabina Nessa, both killed in London while walking alone. Lisa Squire, the mother of Libby Squire, who was killed in Hull by serial sex offender Pavel Reloix in 2019 while walking home, has said women's safety must be prioritized. She said, I have hundreds of messages from women who say they were followed, exposed to. Channel 4's Holly Oaks episode echoes what happened to 21-year-old Libby who was turned away from a nightclub and separated from her friends, before being attacked by Ari Loix. In the long walk home, Maxine is thrown out of a bar and loses her phone and wallet before walking home alone. She is catcalled by a group of men, harassed on public transport and then followed and attacked by a stranger. She blames herself. Ex Corey star Nikki says, This was an important thing for us to tackle. Maxine comes away blaming herself for the attack. But you know it isn't her fault. She should be allowed to go where she wants without feeling she's in danger. It's more about what people could have done to help her. That's what the Enough campaign is about, getting people to change behaviors or realize there are things we can do to help. The episode had an all-female crew, and Nikki says, there were people with us on set who may have experienced being attacked or were close to someone who had been attacked, so it was a very emotional subject. Monday's episode is one of Nikki's proudest professional moments. She says, working alongside the Home Office for its Enough campaign has been an absolute honor. We want to help people be safe. A Home Office spokeswoman said, there is no place in our society for acts of violence against women. Holly Oaks is on weeknights at 6. 30 p.m. on C4 and 7 p.m. on E4. Watch any time on all four. Nikki's episode airs Monday E4, Tuesday C4.
Visit gov.uk slash enough for more on the campaign. If you've been a victim of sexual assault, you can access help and resources via www.rapecrisis.org.uk or calling the National Telephone Helpline on 0808 802 9999.